How are you feeling at this time about the success of Thriller? I mean, the music business isn't exactly going gangbusters, and yet you continue to sell records so well. Um, boy, uh, every time I get a platinum album, uh, it's never been taken lightly on my behalf. I'm always honored, and uh, it's great thanks, you know. I'm very happy that the public enjoy what I do, and I'll continue to, uh, to put my heart into my work. Michael, why is it, do you think, that you're able to cross over when so many <coughs> others aren't able to, from R&B to pop? I mean, it's like a natural for you. you. You have something within your records that everybody just loves. Boy, I, I, I couldn't say. I just create it, and uh, I'm honored that the public enjoy what I do. I couldn't uh, explain why the anatomy of why it happens. There's a formula? Not that I know of. I, it was my heart. I put my heart in it. You put your heart in it? Yeah. When you go about writing, uh, what happens? Um, songs come at the strangest times. I could be walking uh, through a park or something and it'll just hit you. Uh, it's, it's no set time that I write. They come. I, I wrote a song in the Concord, 58,000 feet in the air. In, uh, I didn't have a tape recorder, so I had to remember it. And uh, <laughs> I got home and put it on tape, so they just come. Where do you think the gift came from? God. At this age, you're 24? 24? 30. 30? No, 24. <laughs> <laughs> I love performing. It's, uh, I could sleep on stage. I hate leaving the stage. I was raised on stage, and... Uh, when I'm not on stage, I'm not as happy, and everything seems to be foreign to me, or new. And I'm just now beginning to enjoy friendship, which is new for me. Friendship? Mm hmm With people other than in show business? Yeah. With ladies? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is there someone very important in your life at this point? Mm, yes. <laughs> how do you feel, and how have you felt over the years, about the crowds who I mean, even come up on stage and try to get near you. What what goes through your mind when that happens? Um, that they enjoy what I do, and uh, they want to shake my hand or touch me, and uh, I think it's wonderful if that's what they want to do, and it's a good thing. And uh, if I'm projecting something that is good, I think it's wonderful. But at the same time, I mean... As long as they don't hurt me. <laughs> but being the private kind of person that you are, I mean, some people love it, you know, there's some people love it when fans just whoosh, swoop Not over me. them. It hurts to be mobbed. I bet it does. Like a spaghetti with a thousand hands coming at it. Yeah. Um, um, I appreciate them enjoying my music and what I do. And uh, I guess that's their way of showing how much they love you. But is that a difficult time for you? When people come up to you and... Uh, uh, no, I've learned how to handle it. How is that? Uh, just to be kind to them and uh, wave at them. Or if they want an autograph, give them an autograph. Mm -hmm. But security usually take care of anybody who is rough or who really wants to pull you or grab you. Mm -hmm. You were talking about being on stage, but what, what is it that goes through your mind when you perform? Um, I don't think about much. I, I don't think at all, actually. I'm feeling it. It's not a thing of thinking or mechanics. It's all spirit and feeling. And sometime, every once in a while, I'll think about the next flight, tomorrow's flight, or where we're going to be. But it's mainly I'm so much in, into the music, I don't think. Your music crosses over, you know, to all different styles and that other um, artists haven't done this before? Well, I, like I said before, I create right from the heart. There's no um, chemistry that I know of. I just project what I feel. I was, the biggest influence for me was the 60s, uh, the Motown and the Beatles uh, and the Carpenters. And I don't know if all that had a big influence on me. I'm sure it did. And I just project how I feel. What's the very best thing, um, Michael, that, that could happen to you in terms of, of your career? To continue 
and to continue writing songs and more platinum and triple platinum and making history and breaking records. I love to uh, to create. I love when I'm not creating. I'm not as happy. I feel like I get down and out. I like to stay busy, and uh, I'm very thankful.